What I'm sharing today is a function that I details. Let it work. It is to improve the image quality through noise injection and resampling. Improve details. It is different from the previous lower adding details. This is more precise and controllable. For example, this is how the original image is generated. The details are just not perfect enough. We can solve this problem by injecting noise into the node tool. This detail is optimized to perfection and precise and controllable. And the original image remains unchanged. Of course, you can choose to keep the original image at 80% compared to me. The higher the original image is maintained, the higher the, the more similar. Wrong. On the contrary, the lower the number, the more similar it is. To 90%, it should be 0 0.1. The more dissimilar this is, the more completely it has changed. How to understand this noise generated It's a bit like image. based on your pattern. For example, this it is will become like this. It will be close to this original picture. Just to optimize the details. Then briefly explain how to use it. His node is this node. Through this noise noise. You can understand it as noise. From right? now on, I will call it noise. Think of the original image as decomposition and reconstruction. Here you can overlay some patterns or masks. I only choose to optimize the background or main body. Add details. Just use this mask. Then change its noise map to this. Resubmit this hybrid sampler. Then generate it. It's perfect. Then you can use this to control how similar it is to the original image. Generally speaking, it is similar to 2% here. This is a bit like decomposition and reconstruction. Import a picture. Decompose it through this noise point. Of course, these parameters are all part of the noise. Control size. Degree of blur. Just increase the level of detail. Very perfect and precise control of this kind of pattern or whatever. Let it regenerate, but it was generated based on this original image. So it can easily improve the details of this image quality. Rich in details. For example, this tree originally looked like this. It can improve a lot of details. Equivalent to Laura. That's uncontrollable. Only weights can be added. And you can't add this pattern or anything like that. Its controllability is much worse. So this is currently the most perfect way to add details. I will introduce this function in detail later and explain how to use it. But it's a manual, right? Let me first share a website I discovered today. This website, the URLs are all here. You can check it out in my notes. Just open it at this point, because of his most awesome generative model. There's a link here. 100 free tickets every month, if I have 6 accounts, 6 pieces per month, so it's enough. Here are some simple instructions for use. In my notebook, then its advantage is this model for Toyalism V2. What for Toyalism VR? Just this model. Other such, conventional ones use various large models. 
such as the large model this of station. This is very ordinary. See, the key point is that this website should be generated by the API connected to an IDS large model. The effect it generates is very realistic. Anyway, it is currently number one in terms of realism. Take a look at this effect. This is no longer something that general models can solve. So because this model is very powerful, then these four pictures were generated by me using the most powerful graph generation model at station C, the dominant graph generation model. But the effect is much worse, so it's still far behind NVIDIA. NVIDIA is perfect. Of course, he will make mistakes. With his level of realism, it should be a miracle with great force. Because what everyone right? is best at is their computing his power. His graph generating model should have very high computing power. So, in terms of generating detailed and realistic, this model is the most perfect. Currently, compared to Midjourney or Dolly 3. Here is more awesome. Of course, he just. The advantage is NVIDIA's large model. There is no other advantage. These are just some ordinary AI pictures, online editing, etc., etc. 100 free points every month. Would you like? He was also 100 on the first day he of the month. He will not accumulate. For now, that's all. So I recommend using this NVIDIA model. Okay, now back to R. Adding details to a feature's work. Re must test. A simple understanding is to decompose and reconstruct. According to this noise, regenerate based on this picture. Optimize all the details of this picture. If I don't want to optimize this character, then I'll turn this mask on. It automatically extracts this image. Talk in the background of the main character. To this, the mask curve is used to control. It's the same as Photoshop effect curve. Then try it and let everyone see the effect. He does not accept anything other than this subject. Something other than sampling. The subject remains the same. Enrich all the backgrounds. Vice versa is also the same. It just enriches the subject, not rich background. So this function is very powerful. This easily solves the problem of increasing the controllability of details. I used to use the lower control line before. That's too simple. And you can't overlay subgraphs like this. Then use noise to control. If you want to install this locally, you can click on my notes. Just search. Add detail or inject noise. There's this over here. Note installation. There are also simple instructions for there use. There's also a workflow down This notes. is for local use. You can read my notes. If you use online, then just click on Kaina Yun. Use my online mirror. That's what I'm using now. This is an online mirror. Click and run. If you can see the latest workflow, add details. If you inject noise samples, that means the platform has been updated to the latest version. If you don't see this latest version, then ask the customer when they will update. Just ask again. OK, now the details. This, how to use workflow. This corresponds to the workflow in my notes. Video instruction bar. A video instruction manual corresponding to each workflow. This is the latest one. OK, first of all, we're just a raw graph model. At present, this graph model is better. The advantage is his hands. He can solve things better. Then, this kind of concept map is better generated. Others are just ordinary pictures. The key point here is to take out the seeds and separate them. Because I don't want to regenerate every picture. 
So I took out the seeds and fixed them separately. And then there's this sampler. Can be connected to this noise sampler. Take the generated graph. This is where you can get the sampler. Then we just select this model. Convert this image into noise through this noise sampler. You can simply understand that as decomposition and Break it down based on this image. Let it be regeneration. Of course, if it is a simple decomposition and reconstruction, it seems like the effect just adds more details. Here we can add graphics. This graph is also an art. You can download this. Install this node. Custom nodes install this node. The function of this node is some text processing, or some basic functions of image processing. What are some features of pattern generation? In this way, you can simply generate some chess block through it. Generate some line drawings through this pattern. Just be quick. You don't need to go to a map or anything like then that. Then process it in P S. That would be very strenuous. Then this node just rotates the graph. For example, he may not support moving around so easily or something like that. You can easily switch positions by using it. Then through this superposition, this is some superposition effect of the effect, or multiply and so on. Choose one yourself. This is the superimposed effect. Here is the size of the noise. If you turn it to the lowest, if you look at him, he will be very low. It's blurry. Of course, if this is the case, if you break it down to this level, then its details may increase, and the difference from the original image will be very big. What we need is that it's too delicate. Not very good. We don't need to be so delicate, so we better adjust it to a medium sample. You can try the following for yourself. Anyway, just control this. Noise can be understood as noise in Photoshop. Properties. The principle is the same. The value below is. The image is just added as an overlay. For example, give him a picture group on Let him here. superimpose. If you don't need to superimpose the pictures, you don't need this mod. Just close this. If I don't want to use this overlay, then you close it. There is no such superimposed effect. So here we just choose overlay. Good. Then maybe you think this seems too much. This is too... Obvious. One by one, then we can put this too. Blurry. Not as obvious as him. Effect like this. Maybe all I want is this effect. But this is too. Absolutely not. So this is a level first and then a little bit higher. This is about the same. Not that high, but a little bit. Just those lines that are not stiff. But it seems to be high. Again. A little bit lower. Half and half. Fine tune to get close to. The effect you want. Okay, this is more perfect. Just won't. So much like this picture. According to his free random divergence. You want this mask to control. It's just that what changed him wasn't that big. Then let's turn on this mask. 
In this way, he will produce it and show it to everyone. This is also tricky. For example, if I just use such a pure black and white to cover my blemishes, the effect it produces is that he. This is really because the integration between the original image and the screen is not so perfect. For example, this character is exactly like the original picture. Because it's too white, he will maintain the original effect type 1 to 1. So our mask looks like this, a bit grayer. This should give him a little room to develop. Then open this again. Remember to close this in real time. Slowly merge into this, inside the scene. Or a little lower. This seems to be reserved a lot. If you don't need it, differentiate it. That means just turn it off. That's okay. Let's generate it again. But so. Too similar. Of course, if you need this kind of thing to be closer, that's fine. Improve. If you don't need it, just reduce it. 6 seems to low again. 7 is comparative, just red. Everyone can adjust this by themselves. I won't teach you how to link. I only teach my workflow here. Function manual. Just link the process you use. Okay. I'll share it here for this issue. Let's go play.